So in this problem, we are trying to solve for the current at a, in the coil given to us in the problem stated at a certain time t. So to do that, we have the current of the coil was this. And we know that this symbol is simply that number of the number of turns in the coil times the d phi over dt of the coil. So we can put that as 1 over r for this part. And coil times the absolute value of that over dt. So now that we have that, we can put a few more things out there, such as n coil times pi r squared of the coil, which is the area, over r. And then we have in here, change in time of the magnetic field, which is mu naught number of turns there, charge over length. So now that we have that, we can take a few more things out. I'm just going to erase to make some more room right here. So after all that, we have the n coil times pi r squared of the coil times mu naught i, excuse me, mu naught n of the solenoid over rl, and we have the absolute value of the change in current over time. And from this graph here, it's, excuse me, this points off right there. So, to determine from this graph, we can see that the change in the current is actually 50 amps per second, or excuse me, not 50 amps per second. It is, actually yes, 50 amps per second. So, now that we know that this is 50 amps per second, we could give in all, put in all these values, which I'll do right now, and we'll get 5 pi times 0 0.005 meters squared times 4 pi times 10 to the minus 7th times 120 over 0 0.1 ohms times 0 0.08 times 50 And once we have all that, we'll see that the answer is 0.37 milliamps.